24. The General Store on 24. Pop by and pick up some sliced Dietz and Watson deli meat, freshly made Italian bread, and Lewis Dairy Milk on Route 24 in Lewis. To place your deli or carry out orders, call 302-945-0700. Power 1017. Here's your jacked up stories. Um, power, um, power 1017. All right, well, here are some of the emoji tre- trends for 2020. Emoji trends. Yeah, one in five messages contains at least one emoji. The most popular one of the year is like the face crying, tears of joy. Okay. What is that? Like the laughing, crying faces, maybe? Or the ones with straight down. Oh, right. oh okay. I don't that know. It? Is that supposed to be like laughing, crying? I think so. Well, that's what I use it for. 11, do you think people Which use too many emojis? Use- no. All right, which one do you use when you send like laughing crying faces? Do you use the sideways laughing crying faces or the straight laughing crying both. faces? Yeah, so do I both. Both. It just depends. I'm just here looking at my frequently used, most used. Yeah, see, that's like the sideways smiley. Okay. The up and down smiley. These are my most frequently used right here. The eyeballs, headphones, a mic, a thumbs up, hard eyes, Puerto Rican flag. Uh, <laughs> That's what I have on here as my most used. I don't want to show you my most used. Don't. Because <laughs> I text my wife the most. Don't so. even. Don't even. I don't want to see it. I'm not going to show you. No. Don't worry. No, it's not appropriate. Why is it not appropriate? It's, not. it's a food. Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> I said it to my wife. I don't want to see it. No, because I tell her what. What, <laughs> what you want for dinner? Or what she's having for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Let me, <laughs> let me make a correction. What she's having for dinner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what I want to, what I want to make her for dinner. <laughs> what I want to give her for dinner. <laughs> I can't. On. Hold on. I can't. I Hold can't. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Yes. Hold on. Search emoji. That's the funny ish. I don't care who you are. So you're telling me. <laughs> Hold on. These two emojis right here are your most used emojis. Hold on, wait a minute. I got one more. Hold on. Hold on. I got one more that I'm going to add to the mix. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right? Those are the top three. I know I'm right. I know I'm right. Delete, delete, delete. Get rid of, get rid of, get rid of. I can't. There you go. Okay. Am I right? All right. Next story. You tell her what she's having for dinner, and she tells you what you're having for dinner. Hey. <laughs> and you add that third one, and it's perfect. The, the third one is, is the one. <laughs> <laughs> the third one's the one. Right? That's the one. Yes. The third one's like the outcome. I know, because everybody... Never mind. Because <laughs> everybody what? need that to cook. Oh, we cooking. Right? <laughs> Oh, we cooking. <laughs> we cooking, son. The third son. one that I showed you, everybody needs that. The cook, right? Oh, we yeah. cooking. We cooking, son. <laughs> so there you go. That's what I do. I text my wife. Mm-mm-mm. Wow. Mm-mm-mm. Uh, 11% of drinkers pledge to go alcohol-free in January, according to a new okay. survey. What's wrong with them? But 20%... Have had some drinks already, and another 8% have given up the plan entirely. Oh, all right. And it's already January 12th. They gave up. Good morning, Power 1017. You're live on the air. Yes. Hi. I was hi. calling. I wanted to request a song. Request a song. Perfect timing. Uh, <laughs> what do you want to hear? I want to hear the new song uh, by Ines and Miss Vocals called Come To Me. Oh, okay. All, all right. right. Where are you calling from? I'm calling from Salisbury. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Perfect timing for a song Perfect request. Time. I was going to ask her what is the most used emoji that she uses. Oh. I was going to ask her. 
But she was really into that request. Yeah, she was. So. Uh, a 40-year-old guy in Ohio was playing guitar and singing loudly at 1.30 a.m. on Saturday. So one of his neighbors called the cops. He told them he couldn't turn the volume down because you can't play Led Zeppelin quietly. No, you can't. But then um, they said that he'd be charged with disorderly conduct Ugh. if he did it again. Stop. Old Karen. Man. He has the worst neighbors ever. Her name's Kern. Kern called called wow. the cops on him. Isn't that something? A new survey asked people if their state uh, are usually ruder or more polite than most Americans. Overall, 26% of people said that their state is more polite. 19% said they're ruder and 46% mm-hmm. said they're about the same. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, a new study ranked every state for the best place to raise a family in 2021 to the worst. Based on everything from education to affordability uh, to parks and playgrounds. The best two are Massachusetts and Minnesota. And the worst are New Mexico and Mississippi. Mm-hmm. More, th- more than half of people say they sometimes go for a cheaper generic option when they're buying something to kind of save money. Mm-hmm. Go to the grocery store, you know, they get the food line brand, the great value instead of okay. the name brand. All right. Uh, but... There are some things that we're not willing to compromise. That includes toilet paper, mattresses, coffee, Wi-Fi speed, and chocolate. So I ask you. I I can kind of go along with some of those. When you go to the store, like, do you buy all, like, store brand? Or is there certain things where you're like, nope, got to get the... Mm Got to get the old Turkey Hill ice cream. I think I am guilty of that. So what? Like... I mean, we, we buy a lot of store brand stuff. Mm, like orange juice, let's say. It's okay. always going to be Tropicana. Well, that's fine. I mean, there's certain things. So that, orange juice is get, one. Yeah. So orange juice is it's one. What you kids don't like. Okay. No pulp, calcium, whatever. Yeah. It's just, that's fine. It's what they like. That's fine. And I have tried store brand, and it's just not the not same. Not the same. It yeah. just isn't. There are some things that so, aren't the same. Um, Certain bread. Okay. Jesse and the kids, they like their certain bread. And. I don't get the store brand. Okay. It just, you it pay that extra dollar or two to get yeah. the one. Just is what it is. All right. How, now, how, eggs, I don't think that really matters. I don't right. Even, I just go in and now, how I about look at um, medium. I don't even know what is na- the name on there, but store brand, not just eggs. Uh, I know that, like, how about, how about ice cream? Ice cream, I will say is name brand. There's no. We nor well. There's no, like. We used Store to eat a lot of ice cream in our house. It, more for the kids. Mm-hmm. For the kids. Yeah. For the kids. The, my son eats his ice cream, uh-huh. and he likes Double Dunker Turkey Hill. Okay. There so is no Double Dunker in the other brand. Right. That you know you're going to get that But if we're going to get, and honestly, if we're going to get it like a generic cookies and cream, mm-hmm. the store brand is it's the good? best. Okay. Yeah. I haven't tried that. I think the store brand is better than Briars. I mean, I'm not going to knock it. I would try it. Yeah. And we've, yeah. we've had all different kinds. What, whatever. You know what? Whatever's on sale. Whatever's on sale. Whatever's on sale. Like the ice cream sandwiches, I will say, you can get the store brand of those and they're just as good. Yeah. yeah. Now. We have done that. Like Oreos. Mm-hmm. Can't bend on Oreos. No, you can't. No, because they're no. like thins. Mm-mm. No good. No, you can't do that. Mm-mm. And you know how they do it cheap. Mm-mm. Like with the Oreos, they have the flat where you open it up and you can close it, and yes. it's airtight, so it's yes. like wants to go stale. Yes. With the, uh, the store brand, you have to like open it like through the thing, and you can't. There's no way to close it. Nope. But, like you can't. We've been there. So they go stale. But it's not with the Oreos. It's or just like those sandwich cookies. If you're like, bought before. If you're like my older son, you eat the whole row. You don't have to worry about <laughs> yeah, it. Right, <laughs> no, but what we've done when it's the cookies that you have to open at the side and it's not the pullback seal like you're yeah. talking about, we had to like get the big Ziploc bag. Mm-mm. Then you're putting that inside. Yeah, the but that's Ziploc. a whole nother project. I know. Project. You're trying to keep it fresh. I know. And the top of the Ziploc, that's another thing. If you. You don't get the right Ziploc. It's not going to seal right. We'll see what happened was <laughs> Jess didn't get the the Ziploc bag. I'm here to she tell She left ya. it open and then she got flying squirrels in her uh, ass. No, 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 no. <laughs> then she got rats no, up in her ass. That is not my fault. Whatever's going on up there. Uh, ben and Jerry, speaking of ice cream, just launched two new flavors of ice cream okay. made specifically for dogs. Yeah, there's a peanut butter and pretzel flavor. And a cookie and pumpkin combo. Oh, 
Ooh. But why is that for dogs? That. I think people would I didn't eat that. Think you were going to say that. Uh, the tubs that they come in look exactly like normal Ben and Jerry's ice cream. So be careful when you reach into that freezer, kid. No, no way. Police in Argentina busted an underground swingers party. Jazz. No way. Over the Where? weekend for, for violating COVID restrictions. <laughs> Uh, it was up in North Delaware, nah. but the people there mistook them for strippers. The cops came in and they were like, oh, here we go. Here we go. Take it all. Take it all. Eventually, they made Take it clear it that all. they were not strippers and everyone at the party was sighted. No, that's not how they do it, though. What do you mean? At the swinger party. Oh, you know about it? <laughs> that's not how it. No, 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 no. <laughs> well, when you had your swinger party. <laughs> Uh, a 40-year-old guy in Connecticut was arrested on oh Sunday after he stabbed a Walmart worker when she told him the price of a gallon of milk. Mm. See? Should have stuck with that sore brand. Mm-hmm. Luckily, it sounds like she'll be okay. Oh, good. Um, here's another random uh, product that's having a COVID popularity boost. Crocs. Yes, the sale of Crocs. I believe it. Went up 12% last year, which is more than double the growth that they've been predicting before the pandemic. It seems that people just want... Easy, comfortable comfort, shoes. Comfort. That's it. Maybe even unattractive ones, but is what it is. All right. Uh, a new article on TED.com argues there are seven different types of rest humans need. Different types of rest. Different types of rest. Physical, mental, sensory, creative, emotional, social, and spiritual rest. Mm-hmm. I know that's right. Yes. And here are a few good news stories. Making the rounds, a 13-year-old girl won $50,000 in an essay contest and donated it to her local cat shelter. Okay, for all you pet people. A handyman in the UK has spent over $75,000 of his own money fixing people's plumbing and heating issues for free during the pandemic. And a nursing home in Wisconsin celebrated vaccination day with a disco party. Oh. So there you go. Okay. 948 will continue on the way. We'll wrap up next after Lil Nas X and Holiday. Good morning.